have one. So uh, this is the first of uh, six HTML Pro Series HTML Notepad tutorials. And in this tutorial, I'm gonna show you some of the basics of a full of a Notepad website. So let's get started. So firstly, you wanna open up Notepad. You wanna type in HTML. What well, for those of you who don't know what HTML is? HTML is hypertext markup language. Then you wanna open the head tag. Then you wanna open the title tag. And then I wanna type in this is my first HTML website. Then for closing a tag, you add just a forward slash and type the tag name. Uh, here, in this case, title. So, and now you want to open up the body tag. Well, after you've done that, uh, I would like to type welcome to my first website. Just website and you want to save it as an anywhere actually I'm going to save it to the desktop I want to type in index.html well you could save it like anything but you should have html in the end so just click on save and close that and here you have it here is the index folder so you want to open that well my default browser is google chrome but i'm gonna open it with internet explorer you want to just wait for it to load well um really sorry but this isn't a really f really fast computer as my laptop's gone for repairing my god oh so here you can see it right there welcome to my first website so what if if i want to slowly align this text what do i have to do so you want to open up notepad you want to type in center and then you want to close the center tag When you want to click on file, save, to open up your browser, and then here we have it. Welcome to my first website. So, but I just don't like the look of the text. So, how do I change it? So for doing that, you want to type in font face equals to speech marks, open speech marks, type in Arial and close speech marks and before center, you want to 
close the font tab you wanna click on file save so as you can see the current text is like this but when I click refresh the text changes so now I just wanna increase the size of my text they're too small so what do I have to do so you wanna type in size equals to open speech marks and you wanna type in well by default it is 3 but here we got and so here we're gonna use 5 close speech mark okay so we don't wanna just we don't wanna close the font tag cause it's already closed so I wanna open up my internet explorer click on refresh so as you see the size increased and now what happens if I enter any text outside it outside the tags click on file click on save then click on refresh so as you can see right there so if you want to centrally align this text you want to open up notepad you want to just remove the center tag and put it after the font, uh, anything you have typed so I've typed this as in format text now I want to close the center tag so it's closed I want to click on file save just close it and refresh so as you see it's come like that so now now as you see that they're in the same line as you see right there so what if I wanna provide a line break for providing a line break you wanna uh, just type in BR and this is an exceptional tag because you do not have to close this tag so let me shut you BR tab so I'm gonna type in the BR tag allows you to make a line break click on file, click on save and then as you see right there it's like that well now it becomes like that so then if you wanna just increase the size between these two texts text you wanna just enter another BR tag so after you've done that click on file click on save open your website and now the space is increased between both of them so we wanna make it more simpler for, for our web browser to understand so we wanna close the body tag and then we wanna close the HTML tag and we'll click 
click on file, click on save, refresh, nothing happens because I haven't changed anything. So, bye for now guys, new tutorials coming soon, please favorite, comment and subscribe.